Hi everybody, welcome to Smell What's Cooking. I know it's been a while, so I'm gonna make some, uh, I have some fresh pasta made. I'm gonna put a quick, simple summer sauce together with it. Check it out. All right, so we're gonna start with our sauce first here. I'm gonna use my nonstick wok here. Get the heat going in there. I'll go over my mise en place here. I have some tomatoes, Italian seasoning, capers, packed in salt, garlic, a little bit of chopped onion, black pepper, red pepper, some butter for the end, and some Parmesan cheese for garnish. I already have my water boiling. And we're going to start by getting those tomatoes and onions cooked. So our, let's start with a couple turns of olive oil. Gonna put in a little bit of those hot pepper flakes. That's gonna bring out the flavor, get it into the oil. Also some of that Italian seasoning. Some of the black pepper. We're gonna save some of these for garnish too. Okay, we got a little bit of a sizzle. Now let's add our onion. And with our onion, we're gonna add our tomato. This is gonna go super, super quick. All right, so I just want the tomatoes to blister here just a little bit. I'm gonna turn it down to medium, and we're gonna quick, quick cut our pasta. I already have made sheets of pasta. I made, I've showed you how to make that earlier, part of my kitchen mess. So now I'm just gonna cut them. I just moved that fire down to medium. We got our spaghetti attachment on here. Put it on low. And we just feed it right into the cutter. And out comes our pasta. Quick stir in our tomatoes. All right, our pasta is done. So now we're going to make this all come together really quick. I have my water boiling. I take the noodles, put them right on in.
and let that come back up to the boil. Now, finishing our sauce. We got our garlic, a little toasted. Our tomatoes, kind of, our onions are toasted rather. Our tomatoes are blistered. We're gonna add our garlic. We don't wanna burn our garlic, so this is why it goes in later. We're also gonna add our capers. Gonna give it a nice briny flavor. All right, the sauce is basically done. So now we just need our pasta to come back up to the boil. Gonna move that up here. And as soon as this water comes back up to the boil, our pasta is essentially done. We're going to wait for it to come up to the boil. In about 15 seconds, it's going to be done. Our tomatoes are nice and blistered. They got a little bit of caramelization on them. Our garlic is cooked, but it's not burnt. And now our pasta is done. We're gonna take our pasta directly into our sauce. Water and all, we want that starchiness. All right, now that's our number one burner. We're gonna to toss this all together. Make all those flavors meld. Gonna add the rest of our Italian seasoning, the rest of our black pepper, the rest of our red pepper. And now to finish the sauce, we got everything nice and hot. So we're gonna close the fire. Gotta get these last couple little noodles in there. Get in there. Get in there with your friends, come on. Look at those lovely capers. Now we don't have to add salt to this because those capers had salt. All right, so now we've turned off the flame. Gonna add our butter right on in there. And that butter is gonna stay creamy because we're adding it off the fire. We're gonna take that and just a little bit of our pasta water and that's gonna be our sauce. And just go ahead and mix that all together. Look at that all get creamy and delicious. If you feel like it's getting a little bit too dry, you put a little bit more butter in or just a little bit more pasta water. And just bring it all together. All right. Now this is ready to get plated up. Just gonna take our serving plate here. Grab our pasta and you twist. 
around the fork. Bring it onto the plate. Doesn't that look gorgeous? There we go. Homemade noodles, uh, homemade sauce. Really quick. Simple and easy. Now we're just going to fin finish it off with some Parmigiano cheese. Right on our old box grater here. This is way better than using that craft stuff. All right, and there you go. Quick and fresh pasta. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy. Bon appetit.